Thank you for taking time out of your schedules, especially this time of year when it seems like we've got so much going on to uh, commit your child to be with us this evening for our spring concerts. We certainly appreciate that a lot. Um, I got a sneak peek at the kids a little bit today. They sounded pretty good, to be quite honest with you. But um, I have to also be honest with you, I don't even recognize them anymore. They came in in ties and dress clothes and all those things. They, You cleaned them up pretty well. Nice job. Um, all right, and I've seen a few of them smiling and waving. Parents, go ahead and get your cameras out if you want to do that. They're going to wave right back at you here real quick. So cameras, pictures, kids, wave, smile, say hi to your grandmas and grandpas and everybody real quick. That wasn't very good. You can really wave. There you go. Oh, my gosh. There you go, that's it. No more waving the rest of the night, all right? Hey, a uh, couple of quick comments and then I'll turn it over to Katie Freeborg, our music director. Um, the big thing everybody's always asking me at this time of the year are two things, really. What's the last day of school and what time are the kids getting out? Okay, we got, you guys probably all know now, the last day is that May 30th, it's a Friday. There have been times where we've let out half day and all that. We just got information yesterday afternoon, we'll put it in Parent Portal and all of your announcements and on our website. The release time for Delta Woods on the last day of school will be 1.30, so we'll put the students on the bus at 1.30 and they'll be coming home. Unless you are a, uh, unless you are a music student, you guys have practice later that night until about five or six o'clock in the evening. Um, and then the other thing that we get a lot of phone calls on is what types of uh, activities are there during the uh, summer. We sent out an email blast today. We've put it on our website. A lot of information with all the different uh, camps, clubs, activities that are happening at both Blue Springs High School and Blue Springs South. More Blue Springs South stuff right now just because we have more of their information and when we get the Blue Springs High School stuff, we'll get that on the website as well. There are also several camps that our coaches do at Delta Woods and that information is now on our website um, for the summer. So pretty crazy that we're actually talking about summer. I was telling uh, Ms. Sherman as I walked in this evening, it was a year ago at this time that uh, we, you know, we just passed our $20 million bond to move our administrative offices up to the front of the building and Jill and I and our secretaries were all working out of the small gym. And uh, to be honest with you, it's nice to be out of there, but man, time certainly flies. It's hard to believe that that was a year ago at this time. So anyway, thank you again for being here tonight. I'm going to turn it over to Ms. Freeborg at this time, and we'll get things rolling. All right, guys, thank you all for coming out this evening. I know Mr. Cook already said that. Um, we are starting out tonight with our sixth grade choir, um, and actually... There's tons of them, obviously, but I see them in four different classes. So um, today was the first time these kids sang together since their Christmas concert last time. Um, so it's pretty amazing how everything can come together. We practice in four small classes and then all come together and it sounds awesome. So um, I think you will share the same thoughts as I do with these sixth graders that we have just got amazing talent in our sixth grade class. And it's so exciting um, that they're the youngest ones here and I'm gonna have them for the next two years. So um, I hope you enjoy their performance for you tonight. They are going to start out with the song, There's a Song in Me and Peaceful River. So I hope you enjoy. <laughs>
All right, pretty talented class, right? I was, I was right, yeah. Um, so our last song that we've got for you is um, an African song called Kusi Mama. Um, and I have the English translation in there for you. It's a really short translation. It just means, I stand tall with love, with hope. Children are closer to the earth. And we spent quite a bit of time in class talking about what this meant to us um, and what these words mean to these students. And basically the point of this song is saying, even though we are sixth graders, even though we might look like little kids, we can stand up to stuff in this world and make a difference even though we're small. And so um, they had made an awesome list. All of the classes made a list of the things that they want to stand up to in this world and to make a difference in. And just to give you um, just a broad idea of what they came up with. They want to stand up against bullying, against racism, um, against littering, and against drugs. And that was just four out of a huge list of things. And so that made me really proud to see how good of um, people these kids are as well. So I hope you'll be able to hear that um, and to hear their courage and their strength to stand up against those things in this song. We also have three amazing percussionists that can make their way up here. Um, Tucker Sargent, Spencer Cole, and Holly Rustio are going to play percussion for us today, so you can go ahead and come out. Um, yeah. Again, we never got to practice with these guys until today, so it's pretty awesome that all of this can come together. So I hope you enjoy our final piece, Kusi Mama.